Hey everyone, hope you're all doing good. Yeah, it's Kevin, back for another video, and today we continue Nightwish. So we're going through the album Human Nature, but uh, every track, uh, I've not heard the album before, of course, we're now on track 7 or 8, I think. But yeah, the next track is called Endlessness, and I have the official lyric video up, as you can see. Not heard this track at all, not heard a single second of it. The album has been, yeah, not bad so far. Some tracks I really liked, some not so much. Some were a little bit underwhelming. It's not normally my style of music. I like my music maybe, well, you know, you know, massive fan of, you know, Radiohead, Interpol, Editors, you know, Pink Floyd, you know. The strokes, you can go through, uh, you know, lots of bands and musicians that I like. I really like movie soundtracks. So it's not specifically the music that I listen to. However, I have been impressed by them as a band, as musicians. They seem extremely competent. They're, you know, some really, really nice guitar work and some really nice bass and strings. And they'll Stand out, I think, is Flora's vocals. She's a, a extremely great vocalist, uh, very powerful. Uh, so yeah, we'll see what endlessness has in store for me. So if you don't mind hitting that like button, subscribe, and if you've got anything else you want me to react to, let me know in the comments. Or otherwise, give me a wee bit of background about this song because I will know nothing about it. But anyway, here we go. Let's go on with it. Just pause it quickly. A uh, really nice artwork on the video. That would be. I'd make a nice uh, screensaver or NFT. <laughs> Well, first thing I noticed that obviously it's not floor singing, so yeah, let me know who's singing in this. I really like the guitars at the start, I like the riff, eh, like uh, they had it double tracked as well, which gave it a nice feel. I like that the, the pattern on the drums is really nice as well, it's nothing over complicated and you know, loads and loads of fills happening, it was just really nice, so yeah, so far not bad. Yeah. 
think I heard it was possibly Floor or someone else in the band singing along with them in that chorus there, which did help. I'm not sure about the melody for me. The words were felt like they were dragged out too long uh, between words because there was a long space for at least another three or four words to fit in that sentence, but there was only three or four words. So I'm not a massive fan of that part, but you know, there's still another <laughs> almost five minutes of the song, so it has time to turn it around. It's that second part of the chorus there that I, I like the first part and I like the build up, the, the pre-chorus, verse pre-chorus was nice. But it's that second part there and it kind of drags out a little bit. It's just my thoughts on it. Obviously, more than likely, you, you'll think slightly different. But anyway, I like the song. I like some of the guitar playing. Some of the notes are really good. So as the song structure is good. I'm not a big fan of the melody or his vocals, to be honest, but I am comparing it to Lore, which is obviously, you know, quite hard to do and maybe doing whoever's singing a bit of an injustice. But anyway, we'll go on with it. That's nice. Nice change. I really like that part. I'm guessing that uh, was floor. I really like that. I like the strings. I like the descending strings. They sound really sharp. Uh, reminded me a couple of movie soundtracks. I can't remember the name of the composer. Uh, I can't remember his name. It's like a, it was a composer in the 60s and 70s. But the string arrangements reminded me of uh, that period. But that was nice. I really like that change up there.
nice orchestral vocals at the end. I, I really liked the strings at the end. There was a couple of little three notes that happened were really nice. I think overall the song was okay. For me, the parts where Floor wasn't singing didn't quite work for me. As I mentioned, the first part of the chorus was nice, but the latter part, I just don't know. It just didn't quite sit with me naturally. Uh, in regards to the guitar playing, really nice. There's a nice little guitar solo towards the end of the song as well. Uh, drums and bass were, yeah, really good, really tight. Uh, you can tell they're very tight as a band. When Floor came in singing, I picked up the song a little bit. The strings and her vocals just gave like a brightness to the song that wasn't there before. Uh, I really liked the outro actually. It was really nice, really well done, uh, produced very well. But yeah, so that was Endlessness by Nightwish. So thanks everyone for watching. And yeah, I'll record the next video for Nightwish ASAP and get it uploaded. So let me know what you think of the song in the comments. And if there's anything else you want me to react to, put it on the comments below as well. Alright, thanks everyone. See you on the next one. Take it easy. Bye.